Hi guys, and uh, welcome back to Ripskips. As you see on the desk, I have started, or I am starting, the British Sherman 5C Firefly from RFM, or Rifled Models. Um, but, before I get into where I am with this kit, and what we will be doing further with this kit, I just want to bring your attention to a YouTuber that I have just come across on um, YouTube. A notification came up on my channel and it is for a guy called Mike. The Mike channel is is called uh, a bearded veterans photography now it's currently only got 19 subscribers uh, and a couple of videos that he's posted up um looking box reviews but i'm sure there will be more to come but the only reason i'm i'm bringing this up is mike is a disabled vet now <clears throat> he's married to a lady called kaylee um, but he's a carer for Kay as well. So not only is a disabled vet, he's a carer for his wife as well. Now he's got a passion for photography. And um, he has made it a business. Um, so I want you, those who follow me on YouTube, to support this guy, support his hobby, support his business. By going to his Facebook page, follow him on Facebook. That's Bearded Veteran Photography. And I want you to like and subscribe to his YouTube channel, which is Bearded Veteran Photography. Let's show this man some love from the model community and go and support this guy. Thank you. So the British Sherman 5C Firefly. Rifle models. Where are we at? I have lower hole done. Well, I said done. I have parts of the hole done. We have the... All the back end done up to uh, part 8, which is where I am now, down here. Uh, so we have... Um, the photo which it's showing in, oh God, in place and we need to we need to get this part glued in on here uh, try and work it which way I think it goes that way around I'm not 100% positive connect the image It, but it will go. It's going to go. Go in there. You got your exhausts. There's no interior kit on this, but that will look like that. Rainy camera is. Maybe a bit more light on it will become ungrainy. Okay, so that I've got to glue on there. Got the front. Uh, put on. Oh, okay, and hold tight. Standing on it, jeez. That's my luck. So these will fit. Uh, they will rotate. Um, we've also got the one at the back done. Uh, a little bit of a strange setup with these because these were in two halves. Um, 
I have. Uh, I have uh, glued the halves together and uh, sanded them all down so they look like one piece castings as opposed to two halves. Uh, so yeah, moving back on, we have our springs because we are making Kogi. Rings go oh, up right, inside here. <clears throat> Swings go up inside here to make. I mean, we can see that working suspension. So we just need to do the um, wheels, which are oh, move this up. Again, a couple of pieces down in the bottom half here. They have a front and a back. Still got the other side of this. And then that part will be done. Um, so that's currently where I'm at for this part. So thanks for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being a part of my channel. I do appreciate all you guys. Please, please go over and support. Bearded Veteran Photography on Facebook and YouTube. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye for now.